So I finished this journal yesterday and I thought I'd just do a quick flip through. Okay. So I started it in August in Melbourne at a retreat. And I'm using Kinder Creation stencils, both of them. Adina Page using one of her collage collectives. Um, I'm using a piece from the Travel Journal. And some Adina stuff from Jane. And Arts Inc. from Paul McMillan. Perch. And Adina Stamp. And here's a beautiful Jane Davenport washi tape lady I just absolutely love them They're fantastic uh, one of the life book summit pieces from last year another life book summit piece this one's James and then a follow-on this one also is a summit piece and share this one because it didn't photograph very well but I do like it very much I'm using some Martyrs, beautiful pieces. And this one also is from one of the life book ones um, from Sarah, which I just love that style, it's fantastic. Um, yeah, getting back into my stuff. This is a Stampera rice paper tissue paper piece they're so nice to use Dina inspired piece and back to my own stuff and a little floral playing around with florals is so much fun and this is a day where I just like pump through a few pages that were really nothing but they came out okay. Nothing special. I think I did seven pages in the morning just for some fun. This one. My babies who aren't babies anymore. Kinder Creation stencil here, also here. Using some Caravello stamps designed by Birgit. I did this page and then I did this page and I never did anything else with this page but I quite like the balance of it. Using Children's books is so much fun and taking images from there. I do quite like this page. She's so sweet. Look at her beautiful hair. This one's inspired by the lovely, I can't pronounce it. You know who you are. You're amazing. And this one's inspired by Robert Burridge. Whenever I'm lacking inspiration, I'll usually go and watch a Bob video. Jane, Dina, Dina stamp, stencil stamp, tissue paper, collage paper, I can't even, I don't even remember. It's, it's a collage. Stampera Owl, Kinder Creation stencil. Jane washi tape lady I just love this stamp if you are curious to know what it is it's from um, stamping up we 
here it is. Love it. Again, Kinder Creations stencil. Um, a Dana stencil. Lovely Jane Lady in the sticker book. Marta's beautiful stencil here. I just love this one. So here I'm starting the first page of my 100 days here. So you've seen all these, but we'll just have a quick flip through. Stencil overload, cover, color overload, polymer Ellen Perich stent, uh, hand drawn piece. Um, she's from Arts Inc. Definitely check her out if you haven't already. Kat Von D. Being the queen that she is. One of my Men With Wings series. Tribute to Banksy. I'm a legend. Um, taken from a travel book or a taken from the photo photography books. This one's from Marta's stamp stamps and one of Dina's stencils. This is also Dina's stencil. Actually it's a crafters workshop stencil but designed by Dina. And I did a image transfer that didn't really work so she got a makeover. doing florals and the gold leaf just looks so delightful these are from Paula McMillan Perich and Arts Inc these um, ice stickers Arts Inc this is one of Dina's a tribute to Dina this piece here is actually one piece of chipboard that I separated into three. I also don't particularly like working thick in my journal so it's a good way to keep it thin. This is a serviette that I've added to there and I was feeling a bit flat and needed a bit of um, a change from the format that I was working in so I just stuck a bit of paper watercolor paper in here just to add and some Hambly for all those rooms that remember the Hambly days this is a drawing for a picture from travel journal this is the journal I use Amazing photos from around the world. So that's what I use at the moment. It's very thick. And I've just painted that landscaping in the back there. Inspired by the lovely Ruby who put up this beautiful photo of herself. And I just wanted to challenge myself a little bit and work with shadows, and light, light and dark. It's a Dina collage tissue paper and a bit of cocoa vanilla paper in there for a bit of detail. I have no idea what, what brand this is. Again with the Man with Wings series. Again from the travel journal. The travel book from the Lonely Planet. This is a Dina collage piece as well. And another one. I just made my own from Dina's piece because you know you only get a couple. Oops, I lost a wing. I have to stick that one back on. I use one of Jane's stamps for her face and just running through these ones 
Adina collage heart. Kinder Creation stencil. The Jane lady. They made some rainbows. I did have a sticking issue here. So it's now got Doylent's wax on it. And every page from now on has Doylent's wax on it. Another floral. This is from Marta. Stamp from Marta. Collage. Uh, collage piece with the travel book. Magazine piece. Shireen. It looks like you. A bit of a mix. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, this is a Stampira rice paper piece. Uh, I was inspired by Mindy, but she's got bad eyebrows, so unless we talk about it the best. I just found this piece, it was actually a triangle, and I cut it to a circle. Uh, again, with the Paula's stickers. Stampira from the Travel Journal. I'm lusting this particular stencil at the moment. It's from Finna Bear and uh, Prima Make It. So definitely, honey, it's called Gothic. This one's inspired by Sage Barnes. If you don't know him, definitely check him out on Instagram. He's fantastic. It's a Michelle Grant design piece. I'm using a Kinder Creation stencil in the background. And this font stencil is from Flutter by Designs. I'm loving this piece, Michelle. I particularly love this lady. She's gorgeous. And again, with Michelle Grant designs. This is a Prima stencil, Finna Bear design. A bit of Jane washi tape. And I did rough this one up, Paula. I, um, it still has no depth to it, but you know, it's got some color in it anyway. Let's go sketching again. Okay, and that's it. That's my journal. I finished it. Yay. Let's start another one.